Whoa, hold on. Before starting this video, please be aware that this game is rated M for mature. Good day, ladies, gentlemen, and everybody in between. This is Toad Link here with Persona 5 Episode 79. In the last episode, we kept on, uh, kept on with our combatants, and now we're gonna go see some more. Let's first check our tech messages with, uh, with Fumi, but I think we might want to check the other statements. There's Sojuro, EY, which we can't do, son of a bitch. And uh, there's Oya, I might want to do that because we did Hifumi last time. So let's go, Red Light District. Ah, but before that, I think I need a Devil Persona. Do I? Uh, yes I do. So I gotta go off to the Velvet Room. And this might be a good, good chance to do their request. So, you don't have time to play me playing around, inmate. Hurry back to your prison! It's been a while since I voiced her. Oh boy. You're so violent, you know. Jeez. Hmm? There you are, inmate. Our master admires the progress of your rehabilitation, and hence has given you use of a special ritual. Ooh, nice. It's the electric chair, used to sacrifice personas and transmutate them into high level items. Oh, that's cool. Any further questions regarding this ritual can be directed toward our master himself. Okay. He's apparently gonna consider making even more rituals if your rehabilitation goes as planned. Got it. Work hard for it, inmate. I will, I will, jeez. Thank you. Alright then, maybe we should go check that out. Alright then. Let's see. You certainly seem composed. Welcome to my velvet room. What do you need today? Well, let's go Time for some try out this it will be reborn Ooh. anew. We can get some swords for Yusuke. Looks like it'll become a weapon. We're gonna need to use Amino Uzume and a black katagana to get the Sen Senru Sen Senryu Yaka Yakusha, which is a uh, ooh strength up plus five. Dang, it's good. So this is what it will become sure, into a it. new form. Ah. Oh dear. You can even see the generator that was used to power it. Jesus. This is Senryu Yukasha. Take it with you. I will, I will. Thank you. And I think that's all I can really do, or what I want to do. So I think I need. Let's execute him! Let us begin I think the I need search. A, uh, I need Gather a Neko Shogun, if I'm correct, and I need Kodama and the Sudama. All right. Let um, but us before begin that, search. let's go see if I can see any devils. Ah, yes, I can. A Lilim, huh? All right. Why not me? Um, that's what I have right now. I'm a priestess. I think I might go for the higher level one of Satana Mitra. You okay Mitra. with this? Right. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Uh, why not Makoha? Maybe less boost and Kinga. And why not Sayo? Will it gain new power? Your respective confidant relationship is at rank one. It will receive new power. Are you certain this persona is acceptable? Yeah, sure. My, Go ahead. My. All right. And I uh, don't need this. We've seen it pl plenty of times. There we go. I'm Lilin. I'll leave the realm of dream. I'll I'll leave the realm of dreams for a while to become your mask. Uh, thank you very much. <laughs> All right. Behold, the devil confidant is wakening your po persona's hidden power. All right. And <laughs> nothing happened. Thank you. All right. Um, Let's go back. You change your mind. The inmate needs our guide. You wish for fusion. Yeah, I do have, have Nanzu right there. So I just need a Sudama and Kodama. Now, Justine, these are the paths you have right, walked. Uh, Sandman, no. I think one of them was a Hierophant. Uh, nope, that was Yanzu. That wasn't good. Oops. Lovers, no. Chariot. Justice. I mean, ah, Sudama. Is this what you'll withdraw uh, yeah, this? Yeah, I do. Then accept this persona. And then 
I Kodama. Ah, there you are. Is this what you want? You'll withdraw this for yep. This is your power. Okey-doke. Now, we go to... The inmate needs our guidance. Nope. Let's execute him. Fuse. Can you gather them up? A Neko okay Shogun! Select the so skills nice. you'd like to inherit. Uh, now, if I can remember correct, I need the Kaja, but just in case, I'm gonna need a carriage Kaja and Rakunda. And... Why not? Sharp student. It will receive a fraction uh, of power. Okay, got now it. For a bigger rebirth. one. That's pretty good. Three. That's three executions. Yay. There it is. I'm Neko Shogun. Your future shines bright like a diamond. I'm your mask now. Well, thank you. <laughs> really appreciate it. Yep, yep. Star right. persona. Neko Shogun has learned a new skill in Invigorate. That's nice. And that's about it, because everything else is out of my range. Alright, then. Done already. Uh, no, not yet. I just gotta talk to you. Hello. Huh. What is it, inmate? You need to check on your penial labor? Oh. Oh, good, you're here. It would seem... I can, s I can sense it within you. A Neko Shogun with the Kaja. There we go. Nice. Hmm. <laughs> you're really getting... You're really getting a hang of this whole growth thing. Mm. You alright there, Justine? What's wrong, Justine? It's... it's nothing vital. However, presiding over the growth of another feels almost nostalgic in a way. Do you feel the same, Caroline? What do you mean? We've never taken care of someone like this before. You're not wrong about that. And yet, our duty to aid his rehabilitation aside, observing his growth feels oddly familiar. Excuse me? That can't be right. The inmate's growth and his re and this re re rehabilitation are exact are the exact same thing. Hey, inmate! Hey, inmate! The growth you're getting from these tasks is helping with your rehabilitation, right? Um, probably. I would say. See, Justine, they're the same. Is, is that not something we should judge for ourselves, though? Anyway, Justine, don't forget about our job. The duty we've been handed all this is all that matters. Don't, don't think about anything else. Yes. I suppose you are correct. <sighs> I guess you're getting... We're, you're gonna keep worrying about this till the, till the, till the inmate finishes, finishes his, his rehabilitation, huh, Justine? Look, what you're doing. Look, look what you've done, inmate. Getting all us all wrapped up in your fate. Ugh. Hey. Hmm. You all right there? Could it be? What's up? N nothing. But I believe I am beginning to look forward to seeing whether the inmate can complete his tasks. You heard her. Don't disappoint us, inmate. I. I won't, or at least I will try. I will attempt not to. I feel like my bond with Caroline and Justine is growing deeper. There we go. All right. Nice. Going along just fine. Okay, on to, on to the next task. Justine. Farewell. Ah, yes. Here's the second task you must fulfill before you, before receiving your reward. We would like you, you to harbor a lac... Uh, lac... Es, uh... Lac... Chesis? Uh, whatever. The skill Tetraja within you. You only need to speak with us once you obtain it. We will be able to tell. Okay. Bring us a lac... 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 You hear? No... No... One that knows the Tetraja. Got it. Anyway, off I go! It is time, Return inmate. to your fleeting time of rest. I will try. Goodness. Okay! This is another thing I want to get done here, since I know that Oya gives me charm, and I need more charm. I sense that you have, that you have trouble with women. Hmm? There was a woman last time, too. Wait, is that...? Anyway, please be careful. Well then, shall I read your fortune in detail? 
Yes, please. Okay, please have a seat. Please take a seat. What shall we do? Which fortune would you like to have read to you? Um, luck reading, you said, because that's the only one. Reading a luck improvement in fortune will, co will cost you 5,000 yen. Yeah, let's do it. Ching! Now. Alright. Please think of the area of some area in which you'd like to increase your luck. Charm, please. Hmm. 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 The devil card. It seems like you will greatly benefit from taking actions that will increase your charm. Alright, nice. And that's all for today. And today's improvement reading. What do you think? I hope you're happy with your fortune. I look forward to your next visit. Thank you, Chihaya. Alright, let's head on out. Let's go over to Crossroads and then talk to Oya. Oya, Ouija time. You sure come here a lot. Uh, I forgot, I lost her voice. I don't really mind it, but keep to yourself but keep yourself in check, okay? Mm. I think that's that's killing my voice. Oh god, I gotta remember your voice too. Jeez. Hey! <laughs> oh, there you are. I was wondering my inform where my informant had gone to. Isn't it isn't it warm out? Uh, yeah. Speaking of which, the public's starting to warm up to the Phantom Thieves, your favorites! Have you heard any good gossip? My deadline's coming up and I'm all out of material. Sit down, I'll treat ya. Alright, cool. Are you gonna are you gonna what are you gonna do? Are you gonna hang out with Voya? Yeah, yeah, I will. Hey! For real? From the look of it, you must have you must have good info, huh? Give me the details about the Kamashita incident. Well, I'm I'm gonna go walk around. Let me know when you're ready to leave. Fine, Morgana. I see. I see. A bulletin board, huh? So the calling card they used for Kamashita was different. Now that's a scoop. The kind of information usually doesn't see that light of day. You have a photos you have any photos or video of it? Uh Mishima might. You know that guy I told you referred you to? Nice! You have you have some great connections. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, the phantom hearts of thieves? They sound like a like kids on a playground, not valiant fighters for his, for society. Hey. I mean, they act all high and mighty, and I'm not sure they're really worth very much in the end. Um, worth? Yep. Wait, what, you don't think they're really virtuous, do you? Well... In my line of work, there's no clearer de sign of deception than goodwill. You know, like that sh like the shady actions of a charitable organization, or the, or the actual criteria of a peace prize. Same goes for the Phantom Thieves. You don't have to learn. You have to learn. You just have to learn to take some things with a grain of salt. Come on, don't be such a downer. Why? Why? It's the, tr it's the truth. There you go again. You you used to be so positive. Hmm. Ugh. Oh, shut it. I don't care about the past. Give me some sushi. I don't think this is that type of place. We're all out. Hey, why did you go back to covering politics? No can do. I've been permanently resigned to the culture and entertainment department. Ooh, tabloids, yeesh. Ah, what a creepy, what a crappy company. I mean, it's already been over a year since the incident. Incident, you say? Oh, by the incident, uh, incident I mean. T don't say another word. That has nothing to do with my source. Right, sorry. Ugh, damn it, I'm already, damn it, I'm already sobering up. Ugh. Give me your refill, Lala-chan. Jeez, you're such a child sometimes. Hey, hey, you want a drink? You can have some of mine if you want. Ahem. Oh. Whoa, that's some scowl you got there. Anyway. Why are you coming here at this bar if you can't even even drink alcohol? Well, it's really for just for the articles, really. <laughs> That's right. You're a true believer in the Phantom Thieves. Well, at least now I know you're gonna be you're gonna be pretty useful. 
I'm not all I'm not all that interested in the Phantom Thieves myself, but but keep that info coming, all right? Got it. I feel like my bond with Oya is growing deeper. Nice. Ready to. All right. What's taking so long, Lala Chan? I said. Here's my drink. They, they do they call you Escar Go because you're mo you move s as slow as a snail. We're all out of booze. A certain slosh reporter drank it all. Is that kind of bad for business? Can't you just buy some buy more? I'll wait for you forever. <laughs> just kidding. Yeah, I was able to pique Oya's interest with the stories of Phantom Thieves. I feel like my charm has increased. Nice. All right. All right. Well then. See you later. Don't forget to bring me some more juicy, juicy info, okay? Yeah, I kind of lost Oya's voice. I need to, I need to like train myself to get back to that, or at least try to remember how I put it. I know the voice actress used to be Yukiko's from Persona 4 and all, but just can't seem to nail it. Uh, more pointless gossip. I don't really care. We need to get it on with the episode, you know? I've got a little time limit here. Self-imposed one, but still a time limit. Heat wave. Alright. That's what we got. Uh, ah, Mishima. Man, this is crazy. <coughs> oh, sorry. I can't keep up with all, with the con with the cons constant influx of posts. Isn't it tough being popular, Tri Thieves? Anyway, here's the here's the latest lead I have. This one's about seems to be about somebody someone abusing their power. I wonder if it was written by a former employee of, of a company in question of the of the company in question. Apparently, one of the higher ups has been claiming the achievements of his subordinates as his own. Oh, that sucks. That really sucks. Some business sense, I guess. You can't seriously just be accepting that. Now, I know the name of the company, but I don't have any details on the person himself. The company's over in, over in Shinjuku, so try asking around places where businessmen can, can hang out. A bar at night might be a good start. That should be a good place to get more info on this situation. I hope this isn't asking too much of you. Sorry. I'll look, into, look for another one just in case. No. It'd be a shame to let this one slip away. This is a textbook example of corporate exploitation. It might be difficult to get the employees to open up to you, though. Maybe if you get a job in a bar, you'll be able to learn some information. Alright. We aren't just slaves. Uh, aren't, we just aren't your slaves. Alright, then. Uh, let's see what else is about. Oh, what about Takemi? I can't do. Yuji, actually, it might be. I'm a good read. Uh, Makoto. Uh. Since we just did Makoto, we should go for Yuji. Uh, I'm pretty sure I still have my chariot, right? Uh, yep, there he is. Alright, let's head on over to Central Street. Let's <laughs> head over to the arcade where Yuji resides. We'll go for Yuji. Hello. Ah, there you are, our buddy. Stop. <sighs> I'm really not digging all this sitting around crap. So, uh, I've been thinking about what to do with a track team, and I realize I'm not the kind of guy to come up with this epic plan that can save the day. So, I think I'm gonna do this, do this, do this the what, the one way I know how. Can you come with me? Can you come with? All right, sure. Yep, let's hang out with Yuji. I got to tell Nakao. The Kaoka and, and Takai, Takaishi. What's going on with that asshole of a teacher? Let's go. I mean, there's no way the track team's gonna make a comeback without them. I know it's a, I know it's a day off and all, but we're heading over to the school. They've got to be there. Got it. Anything I can do to help? Yeah. So I cut Nakaoka and Takaishi, 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 over here. I'm gonna tell them what what that bastard y Yamauchi is up to. What if they start fighting, though? <laughs> <laughs> you probably didn't realize, but I recorded, but I recorded y Yamauchi's whole combo back at the manja shop. I'm a genius, I know. Uh. Anyways, uh, I might get, I might need some backup here. And you stick around. 
Yeah, no problem. What do you want, Sa Sakamoto? To Kaishi? Nakaoka? What the hell? What? Are you are you guys gonna gang up on me? Nah. Dude, chill. I just want to talk. Listen, this this here is what's really going on with the track team. Oh man, uh, I'll be the rebirth of a team that found themselves in the depths of despair. The public will love it. And the best part is, not only are the are Takayashi's parents loaded, but his mother's the president of the PTA. But until then, he can show he can show the others the value of obedience. This has to be a joke. Yamauchi said he make me the captain? Is this real? It's Yamauchi's voice, ain't it? And, and on top of that, Jit's gonna go down. Jit's gone down just like he said. Yamauchi's right. I don't have a talent. I don't have talent. I'm not like you guys. I, I ran so damn hard, but you two were always so far up ahead. So far ahead. How's a guy like me supposed to succeed? How am I supposed to be proud of myself? Proud? My dad always talks about how proud he is of his son. He told everyone I'd get a track sponsorship like he did. That I'd follow his footsteps as a second generation Taisei grad. And that's why I listened to Yamauchi. He said if I was if I was the captain, he'd write me a great letter of rec. Come on, man. So, you trusted what he was saying about Nakao cause cause the stupid crap like that? Sh shut up! What do you what does a thug like you know? You couldn't you couldn't know how I feel. Nobody does! <clears throat> like hell I don't know. Well, you at least you're honest. How long were we running together, huh? I went through the <coughs> mm, sorry. I went through all sorts of shit with you. Sakamoto. You're, who you're live, who you're living your life for? Your parents, teachers, society. Maybe you should stop trying to live for them and just try living for yourself. You think you gotta be, you gotta be, you gotta be, you gotta betray people to be proud? Well, I. Well, that, that's seriously what you think. You're wrong. Hey, Nakauka, you knew something was up with Yamauchi too, didn't you? I mean, the bastard's never been interested in track before. But you kept quiet. You knew he was walking all over you, and you just let him do it. Yeah, I was afraid. Without Yamauchi, we'd probably still we still wouldn't be a, have a team or a place to belong. I see. You miss running that bad. You know, it ain't so scary not having a place you belong. You can kind of be free that way. If anything, I I'm more scared of being being a crappy person. I mean, I used to live. To be like you guys, afraid, lying to myself. That is, before I met this dude. Aw, Yuji, that's sweet. I don't want to insult you guys or nothing, but I know you're probably real pissed, uh, pissed, uh, pissed about all this. So if you want to hit me or something, go ahead. I'm ready. In that case, if you insist, if you insist. Oh God, he actually did punch him. <laughs> huh? You really doing it? Said it was okay, right? Wait, hold on. Ow! Do you really have to keep swinging so hard? <laughs> I am actually starting to feel a little bit better already. Me too. I think I can finally put all the, all this behind me. Nikaoka, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I keep switching up Takayashi's voice. I'm trying to find a good suit, suitable range for him. It's like different from like Ryuji's. I'm sorry too. So, you want to bring back this? Want to bring back the track team? Hell yeah! And there they go. <sighs> I saw that, right? That was some serious violence. Yeah, I didn't want any part of it. <laughs> but things turn out for the best, you know. Nah, man, I've been, t I've been talking, I've been taking good care of his face. Oh man, I've been taking good care of this face. Look what ended up happening to it. Hey, hey, at least your portrait doesn't show any bruising. Well, either way, they probably film way better now. I think they're gonna be just fine together. Thanks. Hey, <laughs> all it is was watch, you know? You, you're telling me you, you just sat around while I got, well, I got my ass beat. Hell yeah, I did. 
Lopez. Gotta protect this suave face. It's the face of the Phantom Thieves, you know? For real, you were a big help. You were put you were pushing me to be cool that all the time. Right? <laughs> it's kinda like I was doing a sprint. You were running right next to me. <laughs> but I was just standing right here, Ryuji. <sighs> that ain't what I meant. It was like one of them one of the metaphor things. Of course you weren't actually running, dude. <laughs> I feel like my bond with Yuji is going deeper, but not deep enough. Damn it. Alright. Well, that's one more. Alright. Alright. Alright then. Alright, let's head home. I think my mouth's been my mouth's bleeding, so we'll have to eat something some other time. Dude, you might want to get that See checked. Ya. Later. Later, Ryuji. Alright, I think I might be able to squeeze in one more. Confident um, thing about, and then I might be able to uh, probably be able to he end off. Uh, oh yeah, I just did. Yeah. Uh, Sojuro, you I we got no Hifumi, but Chihaya's there. All right. I think I have. A, I think I have a, curse, a fortune persona. Check. Uh, yes, I do. Clotho. Nice. Gotcha. Later, Mishima. We are. Hello. Oh. I sense you have trouble with a woman. Yes, I do. Let's do a verification test. Bring it on! We're not done yet. Done with these tests yet. All right. Cool. My bond with Chihai will grow sooner. Yeah. Let's hang out with her. <laughs> I'm actually doing a reading for a client right now, so please stay and watch. You got it. Good evening. This is your first time coming to my stand, yes? Yeah, um, a colleague of mine recommended you. He said you help fix my problem. He said you could, you can help fix my problems. Is that right? Yes. Of course. Fate is absolute. Ah. He's paused and he's made It's working. So, um, the thing is, I'm engaged. I'm engaged to be married. Next spring, I'll be tying the knot with a friend I've had since, uh, since all the way back in preschool. Aw, that's cute! Aw, man, that's always so that's always so cool. To have, like, a best friend and to turn an eventual lover throughout that long. It's actually really impressive. <laughs> that's wonderful! Congratulations! So, what's worrying you? Is that the, is it the, date, is it the date of the ceremony? Or perhaps the location of your honeymoon? Uh, oh, um... It's no, it's not like that. The problem is, I'm not entirely sure we'll be able to get married. The truth is, the president of one of my major business partners has offered me her daughter's hand. Okay. Hopefully, that daughter's of age. What? Ah, so that is what it means to be weighed down by societal obligations. Oh boy. Yeah, I know the feeling. Do um. Do you think it would be bad if I declined the president's offer? <laughs> Please relax. The divine power will bring us your answer. See what we got? Yes, I've seen everything. My, it seems your face you will face financial ruin if you decline. No! Does this mean, does this mean breaking off my engagement is the only option? Um, Rinkyu-san, this may be a good time to demonstrate your powers. This man is beyond, is bound by the fetters of societal obligation. How would, how should he move forward? To be honest, follow your heart. I'm, I'm a true believer in like, always following your true self. Follow your heart. <laughs> oh, that's a wonderful suggestion. Though, I guess anyone could have come up with that answer. Incidentally, what would, it, what would you say make him choose his childhood friend? <laughs> Marriage kills off individuality? <laughs> Hell no! Should be sad if you break it off? Uh, maybe. But I'm gonna be a little bit cheeky and say thieves may steal her away. <laughs> what? Thieves? She's not a child. Wait, you really think someone else could take, try to go after her? Well, possibly. There's just never. Whatever. Go, moving on. Huh. 
I guess guys would line up to date such an amazing girl. Aw, he, really, he truly does care for her. Well, I'm not gonna let that happen. The only one who can make her happy is me. Well, that was a fool for hesitation, even for a moment. I'm going to marry her. Thank you so, thank you so much. Uh, it's happened again. <sighs> so, you have altered his fate once more. His fortune now states that he will, will be quite successful. I had to question your powers, but this is the third time. Third time's the charm, you know. I have no choice. I must accept that fate can, in fact, be changed. Nice. You've proven that, you've proven that to me. <laughs> and as a sign of thanks for showing me the truth, I'll provide a special fortune service for you, for, for you from now on. He sends Jihaya's intense motivation. Nice. There we go. Money reading. Temporarily increases money earned from battle. Ooh, alright. That could be good if we're heading into mementos. Or maybe like um, to uh, dungeon. Um, you know, I never thought it was possible to change destiny. Are you perhaps a psychic? <laughs> I'm not, sorry, Chihaya. I'm just a regular guy. I see. I wish there was a way I could I could meet I could meet one. But for now, that wish only reminds me of my inability to change my own fate. I will forever be a monster. A monster, you say? Oh, um oh, my! It's gone so it's gone so late. I should start packing up for today. I'll see you next time. Goodbye! Farewell! Later, Chiaya. Alright, let's get to the next day and then we'll end up the episode. Ugh, what? Huh? Who would that be at this hour? I don't know, let's see. Hopefully it's not an obligation. I'm gonna be on i I'm gonna be on standby at the hideout. I'll bring over a DVD that's perfect for the for this stinking hot summer. We could watch it in your room, yeah? That settles it. See it that settles it. See you tomorrow. Uh, dude, I had no input on this. We should be get some sleep. If for you he's gonna be here during the day tomorrow. Yeah, sleep it is. All right. And as a new dawn, as a new day dawns on this August third, we find ourselves with pouring rain. Hey, Canopio, one of your friends here is, to, is here to visit. Sounds like Ryuji's downstairs. Come on, let's go downstairs. All right. But in the meantime, everybody, that'll be it for today. And see you all in a few seconds for the diary entry. Later, everybody. We continue making the most out of our summer by talking and growing closer with our confidants.